Hey, what's up, everybody? Akeem here, and in today's Fix of Entertainment news, we've got the lowdown on the Dragon Ball theme park, the Penguin trailer, and an update on the creator of One Piece taking a brief hiatus. This is your Entertainment Fix. <laughs> Looks like it might be time to say Shala, head Shala, and head on down to Saudi Arabia as the Quadilla Investment Company is cooking up a Dragon Ball theme park. Yeah, and the size of this theme park will be massive at over 500,000 square feet, boasting such iconic locales as Kame House, Beerus's Planet, and the Capsule Corporation, and many more DBZ fans will recognize. Now, construction on the theme park is underway, so no date on when we can expect it to arrive. Now, I definitely gotta read what it says on the website to give you a better picture of what we can expect. At the park, visitors will be able to join an adventure with Goku and pals as they enjoy the world of Dragon Ball. From the very beginning of the anime all the way up through Dragon Ball Super. This theme park will feature five state-of-the-art rides as part of a lineup of 30-plus attractions. And, if that wasn't already exciting enough, construction of a 70-meter-high Shinron is also planned. With this landmark containing a large-scale roller coaster inside. In addition, there will also be fully stocked hotels and restaurants available at the park to enable fans to immerse themselves in the world of Dragon Ball for an entire day of fun. Yeah, Dragon Ball is one of the few anime IPs to have a dedicated theme park coming to the public, and with it being in Saudi Arabia, it speaks to the, the global notoriety and popularity of the late Akira Toriyama creation. What are some of the things you hope to see in the theme park? Well, me personally, I'm hoping that, you know, there's a way to collect like seven Dragon Balls that, that are possibly hidden throughout the theme park. And I don't know, if you're lucky enough to find all seven of them, you can make a wish. I don't know what that wish would entail. Maybe you'll get like an express pass to skip the line. Who knows? But anyways, what would you like to see in the theme park? Well, find out in the next exciting episode of the comment section down below. Just, yeah, drop your comments and let us know what you think. In other news, the Penguin trailer is out, baby. Now, coming this fall, we'll be seeing one of Batman's formidable foes in his very own series. The eight-episode series stars Colin Farrell as the Gotham gangster, with Matt Reeves serving as executive producer on the series. The Penguin is being billed as the next chapter in the Batman movie franchise. Now, as for the official sequel to The Batman, we can expect Robert Pattinson to return as the Cape Crusader October 2nd, 2026 in Batman Part 2. And finally, Oda-san is taking a break from One Piece. But don't worry, it won't be for too long. In a handwritten message, Oda-san explains that the break is due to Toriyama Sensei's unfortunate past, which has caused him to worry about his very own health, now, as well as take a step back and kind of just think about his creation, One Piece, and the direction he wants to take the franchise overall. Taking care of yourself is very important, so you don't have to worry about us, Oda-san. We'll be here waiting. And that about wraps it up for your fix of entertainment news for today. I'm Akeem Lawanson. Thank you for watching. Now that you're caught up on today's news, please check out our previous episode. Download the IGN app on all your devices, and for everything else, stick with IGN. <laughs>